What's up guys and welcome back to Lego City Undercover. And today we're gonna be continuing on with chapter seven, one last job for Chan. It looks like we got ourselves a call, so let's go ahead and answer it. Hello. Driver. I know nothing. <laughs> Don't worry, most of my staff are morons. But not you, I like you a lot. Thanks. Wait, I did that wrong. Can I help you, sir? Yes, I have a job for you. Get to the Crescent Park Wharf. Now! All right, which way are we going? Am I going the right way right now? Um, looks like it, okay. We'll go ahead and go this way then. Okay, I haven't played the game in a little while, so thank you guys so much for your patience, but I'm glad to be back playing it. It's a lot of fun, of course, so we're just gonna go ahead and get it done and play some more. I definitely wanna beat this game. I probably won't be playing, you know, all of the bonus stuff afterwards, but I definitely wanna go ahead and jam out with, you know, the main story, do all the proper chapters like we've been doing in each and every episode, just because they're a lot of fun and this story is really cool and it's just a fun Lego game. But there has been a lot of LEGO news since I last, of course, you know, joined you guys for a previous episode of LEGO City Undercover. If you guys don't know, they announced a brand new LEGO game, of course, which was um, LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2. Now, I've played a little bit of LEGO Marvel Super Heroes on the channel before. I don't know if I'll be playing this new one. We'll have to decide when the time comes, but um, I, I know that also, you know, LEGO Dimensions be going through some stuff. LEGO Dimensions Wave 8 came out. I unboxed that on the channel. And LEGO Dimensions Wave 9 has basically been confirmed. I know, I guess spoilers, but there's been confirmed Powerpuff Girls. I know there's been confirmed Beetlejuice. I think one other thing. Or was it just Powerpuff Girls and Beetlejuice? I think there was, oh yeah, that's right, Teen Titans. Okay, yeah, Teen Titans is really cool. I think there was uh, Starfire and Raven? Maybe Raven wasn't announced yet, but there is at least some kind of Teen Titans stuff coming. Now, I think it's the new Teen Titans, not the Teen Titans I watched when I was a youngster, a young little zebra on the prowl, but <laughs> that's okay. It's still Teen Titans, and I still love those characters, so that's still pretty cool. Um, I think, yeah, that's, that's all that's going on with Wave 9, but there's still a lot of cool LEGO stuff going on, though, and it's pretty darn exciting, and I'm trying to hit as much as I can here to, you know, earn up whatever I can. So let's go ahead. Can I charge you that? I can. Wow. Okay. Repairing, oh, look at us. Okay, get this, and then that, and we're still going the right way, right? Yeah, it looks like it. Oh um, man, I actually really missed this game. Oh, let's get up here, and let's get up here, and let's get up here. I actually need to remember to turn on, maybe I should do that right now. Let me go ahead and turn on the stun multiplier in a second. Oh boy, big jump! Oh man, that was an awesome shortcut. I don't know if we've taken that one, but I'm pretty sure we just landed on somebody. It looks really quickly. Um, Option, no, extras. Um, Where is it? <laughs> we got, Ringtone belch, there, no. boop, boop. there you go. So now we got times eight. That's definitely gonna get us all the sudden multipliers we need. Out of here, buddy. <laughs> Why is he riding a, a lawnmower or whatever that was? Maybe it was a tractor? No, in this kind of area, it doesn't seem like it's a very safe environment. You would think there would be no motorized vehicles in a park, not their official personnel. So where are we going exactly? Oh, we're going down here. Oh, we missed our stop. Okay, city me. Let's, oh, I can't, oh, that's not made out of Lego. It was hard to tell there, but I guess that is a non-Lego sign, so we can't break through. There it is. Oh, wow, look at this old school car. Oh, that's really cool. Whoop! <laughs> Leaving our car in the water. Yeah, we drove right by it. I'm so silly. All right, let's go ahead and check out this. Are you there yet? Yep. Yeah. This job was meant to be for Feng, but I can't find him. Or Lee, or Fu, or Ping. Maybe they're all getting coffee? Are you saying my coffee is bad? No! Something's up, and the only men I have left are you. And this bunch of dregs! <sighs> so, with all my most trusted employees missing, you're going to have to do the job for me. What is it? I'll give you the details later. No one can know about this. Just take my boat from the wharf and get to Apollo Island. No! All right, all right, don't need to rush me. So that's the island we're getting to. All right, well, it looks like, you know, it's doing that part for us, but we are on a whole different part of the city. I mean, sort of, it's an island, but you can see it in the background. Oh, no, no, we didn't, we're still here. Okay, well, oh, do we really get to drive ourselves? Okay, that's great, because that's what I wanted. I just didn't think that was gonna happen. Well, let's go. So where are we going, we're going this way. Is there, there's no speed boost for this, that stinks, so on. But it does have a horn, which is sort of weird. Oh, can we go off this big boost? Look at this, it reminds me of like Crash Bandicoot 3. Sort of, kind of. It's a little bit of a stretch, but there were levels where you could ride a little jet ski and take off ramps in the water like this, so. Just reminds me of it in that way. You'd think that a cool 
you know, gang leader would have a really cool speed boot boat, but also would be speed boosted with like nitrous, like all the other police cars, but no, not this time. Well, I'm glad we got the times eight. I'm pretty sure it's gonna make things a whole lot easier for us. But man, I did miss playing this game, it's a lot of fun. But we got a long way to go, it looks like, but it doesn't look like we actually get too much for taking these ramps. It's just fun to do. I mean, that's really weird. Why don't we get anything for that? That's just odd. For Lego games, usually you get bonuses for doing anything, even if it's nothing. So it's just really weird, but it looks like there's a little river we can go down here that cuts through the city. Ooh, I like it. That is so cool. All right, well, I like how this is supposed to be like a Chinatown area. I know there's a Chinatown in New York. I think I've been there before, maybe once when I was really young. I've been to New York a few times. I haven't been to any really other major cities though. Like I haven't traveled too much in my life. I don't know, like I, I, I really don't like traveling. Like I know some people like they need to visit places cause you know like it's better than you know seeing it through a picture or video, but I'm never really like that. I'm pretty much, you know, I just sort of do what I think is fun and sometimes when I'm just going out traveling, I'm like, oh, I wish I was home playing video games. So, you know. But I've been to New York, I've been to Boston once for a gaming convention, that was for PAX East back in 2015. I think those are the two major cities I've been to. Beyond that, like, I don't think there's any other major cities I've really been to. Whoa, look at us getting all these studs at the least. We have over a million studs now. Hopefully we can get two million soon. I I'm gonna guess that we can if we of course have uh, the times eight multiplier. Cause I know it goes super high. Of course these multipliers usually end up going like what, times 2000, it's insane. Cause it's, you pick up a purple stud you get like, Two million coins, or like twenty million, really. I'm on another job for Chan, and I get the feeling it won't be just a sports car this time. I'm headed to Apollo Island. What on earth could Rex want Chan to get from there? No idea, but this feels like a clue to me, Ellie. A big, fat clue. I'll update you once I know more. All right. Well, we're almost there, so won't be too much longer. Whoa, we're starting to bounce. There are some waves out here. We're like way out here in the ocean. This is sort of spooky. We have reached our destination. Pretty darn cool. Have you got to Apollo Island, driver? Yep. Yes, sir. Good. I want you to steal a oh. moon buggy. A moon what? buggy? Well, what did you think I sent you to Apollo Island for? Ice cream. Yeah. Very nice. Just get into the space center and steal a moon buggy! Okay, jeez. It's demanding. Find a disguise so I can get into the oh. <laughs> I got it during the cutscene. Whoops. Well, there you go. Look at this. Whoa, Branford Cubbery? Who's that? And we got a gold brick for that out of 450. Forgot how many there were. Well, that's what I had to do, right? So we got to go in here and, and try out our new disguise. This is exciting. So what is it going to be in? I think in here? No. Maybe in here? Locked, locked, locked. Civilian police criminals minors. It wouldn't be in here. It wouldn't, well, would it be a civilian then? Residence locked, locked, locked. I'm sort of confused. Would it be in residence then? Um, okay. I didn't need to be anybody in particular to open this. I don't understand where the, uh, the, the astronaut dude is, but I guess I don't need him. Okay. Yeah, it was weird. I thought, oh, this thing is so cool. Ooh, this thing is awesome. This is like some kind of space rover. Man, this is awesome, I love this. So we're gonna go this way. Now, oh gosh, how much does this thing cost? Probably a lot of money and I just rammed it into a pole. Why do we gotta go this way? I can't go that way. Can I go other ways? Why is it telling me to go through the way I can't go if I can just go up here? Oh, there's another one. I don't know if I should be grabbing this stuff now, if I can grab it later. I'll grab it. Here, let's go ahead and bada boom, this is a slogger. Cool. And usually, I probably should avoid that stuff and maybe, you know, get it after we're done the main story. Like, I should probably only be getting the main story stuff during the main story. Oh boy. Yeah, now we're here. Nobody really cares? Interesting. Yeah, this is like a whole space center though, which is super cool, I love it. <laughs> this guy's walking Maybe like with a sunch. Had to be so cool. Okay. I mean, I think we do actually find a spacesuit. We'll find out. I went away to the space center and look around for a new disguise. So it was telling me to do something with this thing. Bada boom. Build this up. And what will this be? Something I can't do. This ability is locked. Continue destroy mode. 
get new disguises and abilities. Okay, but that's something I needed to do. Like, okay, I think this is something I need to be a spaceman for, right? I don't get it, what am I missing? Well, it's telling me I can go this way still? Well, it's telling me to get up on top of that, but I might have to go back to the disguise boost because I must be missing something. So I guess what I'm supposed to do is go over here and get stuff done, which is just really weird, because it, like, it obviously was trying to hint that I'm supposed to do one thing. I don't know, that's just sort of weird to me, but yeah, we're not supposed to unlock the costume at this point, which is weird, because it told me I unlocked, uh, unlocked the costume, so why can't I wear the costume I unlocked? I don't get that. But there's something over here we can't do. Can I do anything about these? I guess not, but I do have the color blaster, so maybe I just have to do something with this. And now I have this color. Uh, I forget what I do with this darn thing. Um, I guess we'll find out? I mean, huh, find a way into, okay, now I can break this. And can I break this one? Um, I cannot. Maybe I need to be the other color for this one. So let me go ahead and try that again. Switch back to the blue, or the purple, or whatever. And I still can't break this one. What am I doing now? Oh no, I can just break it like that. So it's not, uh, that whatever the co uh, go color of the gun there, doesn't really matter for this. Maybe it'll matter for this. Okay, here we go, here's a wardrobe. Yahoo, so this is the guy we unlocked. You have unlocked Chase McCain Astronaut. I don't know who the other guy we unlocked was, but you know what, I think it is, is that he's in this astronaut character, char char I can't say that word for source. Category, not category. What the heck am I talking about? So, um, I don't know what we're gonna be using that color for, but for right now, well, I should probably switch back to the one I need then, because we already had it on purple, and it wanted us to switch to blue. So we'll do that, just in case. And we'll switch back to here, and we'll work with this. Now we're an astronaut, so now we can do stuff over here finally. Jeez, it may take forever. Why does this guy slouch so much? Maybe his jetpack is super heavy, but he's just like, oh, it's so heavy. Okay, so, oh, what am I supposed to do? Uh, I might have messed that up. I didn't see anything. Okay, okay, that's not too bad. There you go. <laughs> not too bad at all. Once you actually see what it's trying to say, it's a little game as Simon says that's incredibly easy. That was pretty crazy. So it just beamed down some bricks from like the mothership. Interesting, do we ever get to go to space? Cause that would be super cool. Oh, and this is where we can blast it with the, the, the blaster. Um, yeah, okay, so that's not the color gun. But this is. There you go, okay, so. And I can just hop up here as Chase McCain, which is, you know, or this guy. So that's pretty cool. So I'm not on that level yet, so I don't have to worry about collecting that stuff, so that's nice and good. But I can, oh boy, I almost fell there. Oh boy, oh boy, and we have reached our destination, which is nice and good. So I need to, can I do this as a criminal? No, I need to be uh. Oh, I mean, I guess I could do as you, right? No? Here, hold on. Yeah, undercover chase, okay, that's that works, that's fine. And let's bring ourselves on up and start building this. Ooh, gotcha. So, there we go. Oh, this is teleporting us. I thought it was gonna be like a springboard or something. Nope, it just teleports us somewhere else. That is crazy. What is with that weird tone that plays every once in a while? Oh, <laughs> that was a monkey. <laughs> so they're working on like a satellite in here. Well, they're going to the shuttle bay. Whoa. Sheesh. That is one small step, Foreman. <laughs> Perfect. While they're all busy working on the shuttle, I can just get to the moon buggy, which is somewhere around there. Okay. Uh, Inside in the, the middle ship. of the shuttle. Yikes. Well, let's give it a shot. Steal the moon buggy. Ellie, Chen wants me to take a moon buggy. Wow. Yeah but I can't get to it because it's in the shuttle surrounded by mechanics, and I'm in the control room. Maybe you can do something to get their attention. That's the last thing I want, isn't it? No, because then they'll have to come to the control room, meaning you can sneak into the hangar. Okay, I'll just try pressing some buttons then. What's the worst that can happen? 
Oh. I don't know, you might want to ask this guy. Because <laughs> this is the worst that can happen to him. And then he's down, so we've got times so two I guess right flying now. Flying a rocket is basically the same as being in a rodeo. Oh, maybe. Can we ride this? Oh, yes, we can. Ooh. <laughs> I like it. This is cool. Can I actually control anything? I guess not. Oh, oh, but it gave me a bunch of studs. A bunch of studs. Holy cow. Already halfway through. That's awesome, because this will just give me 8,000 studs. That is so crazy. So I can also beat up some stuff, but I already forgot that it doesn't give you any studs for beating things up in this game. It only gives you the other blocks, but I'm totally fine with that, because I need that stuff too, so. It would be cool if you could get a multiplier for that kind of stuff. And already Lego City Hero, holy cow. That is amazing. So what do we got here? Down, up, right, left. Okay, that's easy. Um, down, up, right, left. Okay, that's gonna be another one. It's gonna beam something down. Well, no, everybody is at the... And yes, handbrake is applied. There's a handbrake in a rocket ship? Oh, good to keep in mind if we ever have to ride it. Let's go ahead and build this. Oh, this is gonna be another teleporter. So we'll use this soon enough, but I don't wanna use it quite yet. And we already have 130,000 studs. Oh, I can, can I blast this? Yo, let's back up a little bit. No, I think there's supposed to be a color gun. So if we could find a color gun that's, I guess, red, that might help us out a little bit. But this is super cool. Like we got ourselves, we're in a cool space, I wanna say space station, but um, space place. <laughs> it's, it's supposed to be like, you know, a place where they work on spaceships, which is so super cool. I like it a lot. I, I don't ever see myself, you know, being a rocket scientist, but I can still appreciate it. So let's go ahead and see if there's anything else around here. Doesn't look like it. So I might as well use this teleporter. Maybe it'll bring me to a color gun location. But I'm so blown away we already have um, the, the full stud meter. Like that was like next to nothing. Like maybe it's a short level. Adam scrambled by a teleport kind of tickles. Oh. Because if not, we'd have one eighth of what we have right now. And we got it at about like 120,000 studs. So we'd be, you know, a long ways away. I don't even know if we'd be able to uh, get close to it without the stud multiplier. I mean, so far I think we've gotten the stud meter almost every time. I think there was only one we haven't gotten so far, but they were all working on this satellite just a couple seconds ago and we go in and blast it. You know how expensive a satellite is? You know the millions of dollars of like government funding we're just obliterating? And we are supposed to be for the people. I don't know about that. Is that a Smash Brothers logo? It looks like the Smash Brothers logo. Maybe it, maybe that, maybe it stands for something else and I'm just, you know, being ignorant. That happens sometimes. So this is another spaceman thing. Give me 8,000 more studs. Is still it is, don't worry. I can confirm that we are pine fresh. I repeat, pine fresh. Yay, it's a big success, we are pine fresh. So what's down here? Oh, a little beeper, so I can go ahead and open this door just so it's easier to travel from A to B. That'll be nice and fun. But what is this thing then? Okay, down, left, right, up. Down, left, right, up. I'm doing it nice and quick now. Oh boy, so that's gonna beam on up. And it's gonna give us more to build over here. What'll this be? I think this is, oh, it's, it's the color gun thing. Okay, great. So it's, oh yeah, that's right. It's weird that, how this works. I'm still sort of figuring it out. Cause like, to get the red one to work, you need a green one. I don't know what the purple one was even for then. Like probably something else not relating to the level. Let's go ahead and blast that. Oh. Check the SRB nozzle flex bearing. Okay. I'll need to tell me what the heck an SRB nozzle flex bearing actually is. Is it the cup holder? No. It would just be called a cup holder. It looks like this track's got a hole in it. It does? Oh, I guess it does. Well, hopefully we can fix that. Oh, it's another painting thing. It would be cool if we could try to get some kits in today's episode. There we go, there's. Okay, that's right. It's weird how this one works. You need to fill up the whole thing. I don't know, it's weird. Oh, I just turned the whole thing green. So what is this right here? I think this is something I can do as a spaceman or not. What exactly is this thing? Um, I'm not entirely sure, but there is something up there. So maybe if I go ahead and, how can I, oh, just like that. Ooh. Oh no, I did that wrong. You gotta do that again and then pull back. Ooh, and hopefully this will be the pieces to our thing or something. Yep, it looks like it. So what is this thing? In flight snacking reserves. Pretzel levels are looking a bit low, but chocolate and candy levels are good. 
chocolate in space? Soda levels at optimum with five different flavors, including two diet sodas. Ew. Diet soda is not that tasty in my opinion. But, you know, that's still really cool though, because I know that what they do is they like they dry the food for um you know astronauts. I gotta be the miner for this. Which is right here. Pick that up. Oh, and we put that down here in this little barrel we saw earlier. It's all coming full circle now. And bada boom. Cool. But yeah, they like they dry the food up when they're in space. I don't know a ton about what it's like to live in space, but I know a little bit, and it's super fascinating. Oh, there's people up here. Oh, they're gonna try to beat me up. Luckily, I got my pickaxe. So let's just start throwing them around. Oh, 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 dodge it. Yeah, get gone. So let's go ahead and cuff you, cuff you, and cuff you. There you go, times three studs there. Very good. There's tons of studs to get around here, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to beat stuff up before we continue on with what we're supposed to do, whatever that might be. Yay! So there's stuff to do over here. There's like a lot of stuff to do in this area, so let me go ahead and do like the beating things up thing first, because I always hate it when there's like more things to do, but we can't do them because we accidentally, you know, progress through the area and it just forces you to the next one. Oh my gosh! We went full on like windmill on that dude. That was crazy. I think Chase McCain should be in the next like Street Fighter game if he's gonna pull out moves like that. Holy cow. Chase McCain for Smash Brothers, bringing that conversation back full circle. Maybe there really is a reason why there's a Smash Brothers logo over here. Oh boy. So can we break the security camera? No, we don't want anybody seeing us. Except that that was a color gun, so it's not gonna change too much. Maybe if I do it with my blaster of space. Okay. Ooh, space blaster. There we go, we can break it. Okay, so what do we gotta do around here? First off, there is a robber thing here. And it looks like there's like some kind of thing right next to us. But I don't know what we do with this. Um, can I? Oh, I need to be, oh, what's his name? That's cool. I didn't know we could, yeah, I, I totally forgot. I guess we can unlock him. That's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and beat this stuff up. Good, good, good. Was that really all that beneficial? Maybe not, but we get some more stuff for it. Okay, so for this one, I need to be normal chase. Well, not normal chase, but uh, I mean, un I don't know if this is undercover chase or whatever. Yeah, this is undercover chase. What am I talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about, dude? I can't do this one quite yet. So maybe I can do that one after I find a way to open that. I guess Man, we have so many studs. Is that disappearing? Okay, that just pops it back there. I was gonna say, are we gonna be stuck in this level? Oh, wrong one. There we go. I do definitely need to change this back to the police officer chase, chase McKinnon if it lets me, just because I think it looks cool. Let's see, we're almost at 400,000 studs right now. Like that is so crazy. And it's just because of this multiplier. Because if we get 400,000 studs, that means that we got, one, we, we would have been normally 50,000 studs if it's a times eight multiplier, so that's just crazy. All right, so we got this one as well. So there's more than one of these things. I don't know how to use them yet. Probably gotta open this up and then go up there. So let's go ahead and another one. Yeah, what am I doing with these? I'm a little confused. We'll get all those, get up here if I can. And then there's a free blue stuff. So we got these three things. It's telling me to use them over here, right? I don't know, it's weird. Well, let's just try it. Let's walk up with it and see what happens. Like, is there a button to press? There's not. Hmm, am I missing something here? Oh, I can just hop up here and, okay. That makes a little more sense. It wasn't super obvious, but you know what? Maybe it doesn't have to be. Can I beat up this? Yes, I can. There's one more thing out of my way. Get this. It's weird how these things are harder to pick up than the studs. Like they just don't have a bigger pickup radius. Which I guess it's because these things are supposed to be harder to get. I mean, we have 20,000 of them, but some of these things, like they cost a lot. And we end up using that 20,000 up pretty darn quick. Let's go ahead and get this one. And let's see what happens when we do this. It's probably gonna open up the front of this because it looks like they're sort of, it's being covered up. Yep, and then we can just Teleport, yeah, okay. And we totally broke on uh, 400,000 there because we picked up a purple stud, which is 80,000 studs, holy cow. But can we, uh, oh boy. I don't know if that's what we wanna do, but we can do it. So let me try to hop up here. It's a little bit of a weird angle. Oh, look at this, it's like a little amusement park ride. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> so it reminds me of like an amusement park ride I used to ride as a kid at like the boardwalk 
where it was like a train on a rail and it would just go through the entire amusement park. It was so cool. Oh, that is so cool. <laughs> but it would go up to the roof like this and it was just super cool. I don't know why, right? I guess just because That's it's on a rail. Get their attention. Okay. I that vent up there leads to the hangar. Oh. All right, well, only one little planet remains. What? That that caused the power levels to drop? All right. And now we're up here and checkpoint complete, saving progress. I wonder if my driving license covers space rockets. Let's hope so. If not, we might be in a, you know, like a situation. Ellie, how do I get the moon buggy out of the shuttle? There should be a button you can press to open its delivery bay. And that'd need power to work, right? Yeah. Why? I think I broke the power supply back there. And now the control room is full of people. Right. Hang on. It's okay. There should be some high-powered lasers in the hangar. You can use them to power up the shuttle. Wow. There is literally nothing you can't find with these online encyclopedias. Okay. Anything else I should know? The annual rainfall in Lego City? Thanks, Ellie. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and try to blast that. That didn't seem to do anything. I need to find something else then. Can we do this? Yes, we can. It looks like anybody can do that, which is weird. How good is the security system if everybody can do it? <laughs> it looks like that's what we gotta do. So let me pick up these studs, then go back over here. Boom, 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 boom. Got it. Ooh, here we go. Here's a color blaster thingamajig. But yeah, speaking of amusement parks ride, and speaking of space stations, I mean, I, have you guys ever read ridden the, uh, what's it called, Space Mountain? That thing is so much fun. So I'm supposed to color blast this, correct? I guess so. Weird. So that seems to be activating a lot, of, a lot of things. A lot of these little like light lasers we need to refract, which is sort of confusing. It's hard to see them. But um, yeah, that's a really cool amusement park ride. I used to ride that one all the time. That was probably my go-to Disney ride is the Space Mountain one. It's just a lot of fun. Like I know it used to be like really intense when I was younger. It's not that bad of a of a uh, roller coaster for me now. I know my sisters couldn't stand it, <laughs> but I totally could, so it was fine. Let's go ahead and try to uh, build that up, and that's gonna be another one of those. I'm gonna go ahead and do what I did in the last area and just try to beat things up first, and then try to do what I need to do, just so that way I know I'm not missing anything cool, because if I can get 500,000 studs, there we go, in one level, that is insane. Like, I just love getting a bunch of studs. It's super addictive for me, so. That's what I wanna go ahead and try to accomplish now, if I can. And we could probably break this right here, there was stuff in the way. Ooh, what are we pushing here? Something on Labrad. Oh, look at that. So I can color this, but maybe that's not something I want to do for right now. I'm gonna put it over here just because it seems right. Looks like I gotta paint it a certain color. Not really too worried about that. And this has more things to build. Nope, they will all disappear. That was just sort of probably a box that was gonna be in the way. Well, that stuff's just chilling out for us. Like, pick me up, pick me up. Somebody left me here, and I don't want to be here. All right, got this stuff too. But yeah, I don't think there's any other space related. I mean, there is the Buzz Lightyear stuff at Disney World, which is always pretty cool. That, that's sort of a stretch to consider it space related though. But the waiting line was always my, one of my favorite waiting lines in Disney was the uh, Space Mountain one, because you could always see the the the, um, the the roller coaster itself, like through a window and you could, you know, get all this like cool stuff. You could just sort of wait through. It was like, like sort of like a warp tunnel. It was really cool. That's probably my go-to Disney ride, though. I know Universal Studios, um, like, I mean, my Universal Studios go-to ride has changed a lot, because one thing, I just don't go to amusement parks anymore, but when I was a kid, it was always the, uh, the Back to the Future one, which they eventually got rid of, and then the E.T. one was really cool. So what are we doing with this thing over here? There's not too much going on. Oh, I can go in this elevator, maybe? I cannot. <laughs> okay, <laughs> lesson learned. So how can I get this one to reflect if it's facing this way? Seems like a weird spot. Cause how am I gonna get it here? Like maybe I can shoot it? Maybe I should, wait, did I already change the color of my gun? Or did I, you know, neglect to do that? I can't shoot this thing. So that's not what I'm trying to do here. Well, let's try, no, I definitely had it as gray before. So I think it needs to be red for right now. What can I shoot then? Maybe this? Weird. Either way, there's still stuff to do over here. Like, I, it's telling me I can shoot that, which is good to know. The scientist doesn't care about me. 
which is weird because everybody has tried to beat me up around here recently. Well, can I slam on this? I cannot. <laughs> I think that'd be like probably Rex Fury again for that. There's a ton to do in this area for sure. One out of five there. And I have not found any more of those. So chances are I'm not going to find any more, or, or at least I probably won't find all five of them, unless this level is a lot longer than I'm expecting. Because I didn't think this one was going to be super long, but it's actually ending up being a little bit longer than I thought. Because sometimes they have more than one level per chapter, and sometimes they don't. This one has a lot of puzzle elements to it, though. There's two out of five, so maybe, maybe I'm wrong. But this is something. Ah! I need to be somebody I don't have for that one. No taken. Okay, so that's about everything I can do except for the uh, space guy. So we'll go over here and do the space guy. And just. Okay, I guess I must have accidentally exited, but it's pretty simple. It's boop, 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 boop. Yeah. Simon Says is actually a really fun game, though. Like the little. Like there's a game like that where you just, you know, press the colors that it tells you to. That's always fun. Like I'm sure there's like a digital version of that, but it probably wouldn't be as fun as like the physical. But that and like Bop It. <laughs> I don't know if Bop It is still a thing. Like it, anybody who's like younger, have you ever heard of a Bop It? Oh, that's so weird. So can I blast this? I can, but it doesn't do anything. Weird. I, I can. Oh, because I'm using the blaster, not the color thing. I'm a dingus. There we go. So I think what it has to be is that maybe I do have to change the color of it? Because that's not working right there. So maybe it does have to be gray. Which is weird. Why well, give me the option to change the color? So let's go back here and try to change the color again. This is such a weird puzzle element because I just can't. Like, it's just weird. Everything has Laser to be the same one. color, is the thing. Active. Hmm. Well, there's that one done. This one I'm still confused about. Because how do I get something here? Like, maybe there's a stick of dynamite laying around somewhere? And I still can't get down there. Huh, this part's weird. What am I doing wrong? Maybe, oh. Can I shoot this down? No? Oh no, I'm not shooting the right thing. I guess I can't shoot that down. But there is something I can hit here. So let's go back to this guy. We have it as gray right now, but if we turn it, this is what the color changer is for. Am I still not the right character? I'm such a dingus. <laughs> well, there we go. So let's go ahead and do this, because I didn't see this at all. So that's what I was getting stuck on. That's what I was lost on, and that's a lot of studs. If they don't fall off the side! What the heck, game? I was gonna get like an extra 8,000 there if that blue stud didn't fall to its doom. This is exactly what we needed. Oh, no, 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 that's disappearing. Oh, oh come on! That's total malarkey. I mean, I guess I don't need it because I've gotten almost 600,000 studs. Now 600,000 studs, but I, I'm greedy. I can't deny it. So I can turn out the red, but it won't do anything. I'm gonna change back over here. But I'm glad I figured that out. I was getting a little confused there. So it felt like we were doing just about everything here. So we got that, now I'm gonna change the colors of this, and we are done. Connected. Limited shuttle systems activated. Oh, look at that, it's a little space rover. Very cool. So that's activating a bunch of stuff, and finally the elevator. Oh, they, they don't seem happy. <laughs> I think they were a little woozy from the elevator trip. Go just beat them up. There we go. Ooh, we got you good. Let's go ahead and lock you up. You're getting back up for more. I stepped on your toes. Now I stepped on everything else. There we go. So many studs, it's insane. Let's go ahead and do this, because we could just do that as anybody, which still doesn't make any sense. But here comes the elevator. Go on through. No, no, don't get stuck by the doors, that would stink. And we're good to go. Yep, okay, just took its time. Now what are we gonna find up here? Ooh, there's a new thing up there, but I can't quite reach that, I don't think. Some kind of vehicle. Oh, this looks a little scary. Oh, be careful, Chase, be careful. Whoop. And can I sneak up on you? Just give you a blast, I can turn you gray. Whoa, okay, I wasn't prepared for that. Oh, oh I thought I wasn't gonna make it. So I can't do that, I'm not an electrician or something. I can't do this, because there's just nothing to do there. Can I beat up this thing? I can, get two blue pieces. Better than zero blue pieces, you know? Ooh, three out of five, I might actually be able to get all five of those. And we got stuff going on over here. I don't have like the special key card I'm gonna need, so we can just stay as this guy and bust this thing open. And hopefully within here we can find whatever key card we're looking for. Why does it keep, you know, giving me studs that end up falling off the edge? I don't appreciate that too much. What are we gonna find over here, though? Like, it's sort of hard to see at this angle, so. 
Ooh. Nothing in there. But there is a safe to break open. This is weird. Oh, nope, I pressed the wrong button. I think I always press the wrong button. Oh, there we go. And what's inside this one? We got ourselves. Some oh, yeah, here's the key card. Exactly what I wanted. Exactly what I needed. There's nothing in any of these lockers. It's boring. But at least have, you know, a couple of those pieces. The, um, the super bricks, that'd be helpful. Oh, so now we're moving this back over. So that's what the uh, the control panel on the other side is for if we need to bring it all the way back. If we fall off for whatever reason. Oh, and that broke the rover. <laughs> okay. Another probably multi-million dollar project destroyed because Chase McCain needs to solve this crime. Like, I know Rex Fury is a criminal, but is he a criminal that would cost millions if not billions in space exploration material? Because I feel like, like you gotta prioritize. Yeah, this guy might be a jerk. Maybe he like steals from donut shops or something. But it's like, if you, like, I feel like, you know, space exploration is for the greater good of our knowledge of the universe. It's a little bit petty to prioritize your, 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 uh, hey, your feed with them. that's my car. It's not your car. You are so possessive. <laughs> Fine, it's our car, but it isn't his. Come on. Oh boy. I mean, it is true, it ain't ours. We're taking it. <laughs> Hopefully the coffee doesn't get cold. Oh no. So there we go, is that the level finished? Man, this thing tries pretty well, it looked like. There we go, Apollo Island Space Center, level complete, free play unlocked. Very, very cool, and we got two pieces of the police shield, which is very cool. And of course we got this, no problem. That was an easy 100%, but I don't think we're quite done the chapter, we'll have to find out after this is complete, but very cool. How many gold bricks did we get for that? At least one. One, two, that's it, okay. I mean, that's too closer to 450. Let's continue with the story. Driver, bad news. My men aren't waiting for you at the dock. Oh no. Yeah, I can see that. They're running late. And by running late, I mean... Still sat here on their behinds! <gasps> oh, they've actually gone. <gasps> Who am I going to shout at now? They'll be here soon, right? I guess so. Just don't let the moon buggy get damaged until they get there. Oh, I'm going out to the street so I can yell at some strangers. See you, driver. This guy is... He's got some problems. <laughs> and he's not a very good leader if his men just don't care. All right. Well, where are we going? Avoid Apollo Island security until Chan's men arrive. Oh, that's not avoiding. That's the opposite of avoidance. Oh, boy. Well, there goes another couple million for the for the government-funded uh, space program. Oh, gosh. No, this is a dead end. This is a dead end. Can you stop it, sir? You know, okay, these guys aren't any more respective of it if they're riding their million-dollar space, you know, things. Oh, my gosh. We have over two million studs now, though, which is insane. Oh gosh, oh gosh, no! Stop being good at driving! This thing is almost broken already. No, 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 oh, come on. They're really good at driving. I gotta do that again, don't I? Um, maybe I stand here forever. Yeah, we're gonna retry. Do I have to retry everything? No, I don't, okay, thanks, God. thank goodness. But, um, I can't drive, it's not letting me go. It's not letting me go. Ooh, go this way, go this way. Why are they so good at doing that? Their vehicle is like way faster and like has better control than mine does. Let me try driving up here. I just gotta survive for a full minute though. You'd think that wouldn't be so bad, but they're really good at doing stuff. You know, I could maybe like hide under here. Let's just try to hide out. This might be a dumb idea. Let's see. Oh. Oh, it's working. Oh, no, no, it's not. Oh, will they get under here? They will. I gotta, I gotta plop down here. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Please don't find me. I just need to survive here for 25 seconds. I'm actually stuck. No, 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 no. They found me. They found me. Please don't. For 18 seconds, just chill out. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I think he lost his car. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, they, they broke that car, too? What is happening? I do not know, but this is working. I'm stuck. Somebody help. <laughs> I can't believe this is happening right now, but they really can't fit under here. I have found the perfect hiding spot. Hi. Uh-oh. Is he gonna expect me to, like, get the car out of here? Because I'm, like, legitimately stuck. Uh, I hope not. No, we have to drive it. Please don't tell me. No! No, I don't want to exit the story mission. I'm stuck, though. 
No, 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 no. I can't do it. I'm stuck. Oh no. Okay, so I had to redo the little one minute escape mission. Not a big deal. <laughs> I'm not sweating it too much. So we got that done. Now we just gotta go ahead and go through here. And this time I'm not stuck, so that's good. Ooh, excuse me. Whoa, whoa, don't mess up twice now. Don't mess up twice. Ooh, got it. Okay, there we go. About time, guys. Hopefully this guy can ride it a little bit better. No, he cannot. Well, he got it in though, he got it in. And we're off. Hopefully I join them, right? So I don't have to drive myself back. Do I have to drive the ship? I don't know. I guess not. Take it from here. Don't follow us. I'll do what I want. Bye-bye. Enjoy your billion dollar space rover. Now what? I wonder, is that the end of the, uh, oh it is, the end of the chapter. So in the next episode of Lego City Undercover, we'll be tackling chapter eight, The Rescue, which is very cool. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's episode of Lego City Undercover. If you did, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you want to support the video, make sure you comment Astronaut Zebra, so I know you've watched in the video, and you are a Zebra Task viewer. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.